draining your machine at the end of day or service. First, push and release the middle button until the display shows drain. Then, push and release the start button. The machine will now perform a drain stroke self clean cycle. The right hand button will illuminate blue until the cycle is finished. When the drain stroke self clean cycle has finished, the display will show the power symbol. Now you can open it up to clean the filters etc. Open up your hood and remove any baskets on the carriage. Lift up the carriage and hold it out of the way. Now remove the upper and lower wash and rinse arm assemblies and ensure the jets are all clear of debris. Next, remove the scrap trays being careful not to drop the dirt back in the machine. Take these to your bin and scrape off the scraps then over to your pre-wash station to remove any further debris ensuring you wash the, the scrap tray on the top and on the bottom. Now remove the wash pump filter pulling it towards the corner of the machine and make sure you clean it on the outside and the inside. Then take a cloth or paper towel and wipe any remaining debris from in the tank towards the back corner, collect it and remove and dispose. After draining the machine and cleaning the filters you will need to replace them back in the machine. Lift up the carriage and replace the wash pump filter now clean, ensuring it's firmly clipped into position. Next, replace the scrap trays, ensuring they're correctly located. Now, replace the upper and lower wash arm assemblies and upper and lower rinse arm assemblies, ensuring they're correctly fitted and screwed down all the way. Now, bring your basket back across onto the carriage Always leave the hood open overnight to allow the machine to air dry.